Hey, how's it going guys? Mr. Boss for the win here, and in today's GTA 5 video, I'm going to be telling you everything new that Rockstar has introduced today in Grand Theft Auto Online as sort of a continuation of their New Year's 2020 celebration. So I feel like I've been saying this for like three or four days straight now, but again, I apologize for sounding so sickly. It is because I am. I have almost no voice at this point, but I'm still trying to get these videos out for you. So anyways, let's jump into it today and let's get it started. The first thing that Rockstar has done is they have released a brand new vehicle. And I think some of you guys might be a little bit disappointed with this, but it is the Rune Zaba. So on the Newswire, Rockstar says, Big, tough, and relentlessly aggressive, the amphibious Rune Zaba is the jacked-up bullfrog of off-road vehicles. Land, mud, swamp, beach, just launch yourself in and see how far those custom tires take you. Available now from Warstock Cash and Carry. And that is exactly where you will find this vehicle. You can see that its price is $2,400,000 if you want to buy it now. However, if you actually use it during the Diamond Casino Heist as one of your getaway vehicles, you can get it for $1,800,000, essentially saving you six hundred dollars So you can save a little bit of money with this vehicle if you want. And the description is Alien Invasion, The Undead Rising, Hordes of Liberal Art Students, Whatever Threatens Your Way of Life, Make Sure You Have the Upper Hand with the Rune Zaba. The perfect vehicle to raise you up above it all, whether you're grinding bones or crushing hope, Warstock has you covered. So as always, a very funny description from Rockstar. If you guys are interested in all the things you need to know, before you buy this vehicle in online, if that's something you decide to do, I will leave a link to a video we did a couple of days ago in the description that outlines some quirks, features, and general cool things about the Rune Zaba, including how armored it is, and some things, again, that you might not have known about. And in case, for whatever reason, you still weren't excited about this vehicle, Rockstar has actually uploaded a sort of mini trailer to get you guys hyped up about the Rune Zaba, and showcase some of its cool features as well. So that is the new vehicle that Rockstar has opted to release today in Grand Theft Auto Online. Now I'm sure that many of you guys are kind of disappointed that we're not getting something like the Sultan Classic or the Overflawed Immorgon. Well, I would say the only good news out of this, if you are disappointed in the Rune Zaba, is that Rockstar have gone through all of the Warstock Cash and Carry vehicles. That means the only ones that are left are on those two sites, Legendary Motorsports and Southern San Andreas Super Autos. So going forward, all the vehicles are going to be brand new. They're not going to be like, you know, reiterations of existing cars or, you know, weird bullfrog tanks like the Rune Zaba, which, by the way, is the biggest struggle to drive in the snow. That's something we talked about in my, like, quirks and features video, but it's such a pain. So I know people are going to be disappointed in this, but... Have no fear. That means that going forward, all the vehicles are going to be the ones that you're probably all really looking forward to. The next thing that Rockstar is doing is offering some New Year bonuses. They said, look, we get it. New Year, new you, and all that. Shake the dust of yesteryear off by jumping into a game of Hunt the Beast, King of the Castle, or Criminal Damage, especially since you can earn triple rewards on free mode events. Now, if your skill set is more entrepreneurial, you might want to get into the double payouts for business battles until January 8th. And if all else fails, stay away from the sun. The subterranean carnage of the Bunker series is paying out double this week after all. Okay, so those are some pretty awesome money-making opportunities right there. To quickly recap, free mode events will get you three times money in RP. Business Battles, two times money in RP, and the Bunker Series Adversary Mode will get you two times money in RP as well. So that's actually pretty awesome. Some great ways to make money this week, which you might be a little bit short on cash after spending your money on the latest items and online. Now there's also some pretty cool seasonal and festive things still happening in online, and that is a new podium vehicle 
at the lucky wheel. So Rockstar says, if your other endeavors at the Diamond Casino and Resort aren't going your way, maybe you'll have better luck swaggering over to the lobby and giving the lucky wheel a spin for the chance to win RP, clothing, money, and more. And this week's top prize is a customized Fister Comet Safari, adorned with the exclusive It's a Wrap livery for your own flair. And regardless of how you fare, anyone who plays GTA Online before January 8th will still receive the It's a Wrap livery for their Comet Safari to bring in the new year for free. So that's actually pretty cool. The Comet Safari is a really fun vehicle, and that's an exclusive livery that I know a lot of you guys will ultimately enjoy. Now, since we're on that subject of seasonal items, I'm sure you guys have also noticed that the snow is still here, as well as all the festive surprise content. So that's actually kind of surprising. I actually predicted yesterday that Rockstar would remove the snow, as in years past, they've traditionally removed the snow after the first of the year. But I guess they're going to be keeping it for a little while longer. Now, I don't know for how much longer that's going to be. Maybe it has something to do with the snow lasting a certain time in Red Dead Online and Rockstar removing them at the same time. But the snow is still here. All the festive surprise content is still here. So it looks like for a little while longer, we can still enjoy it. Now, there's also some amazing discounts going on this week. Rockstar says, if you're starting the year fresh off a big heist payday, there are plenty of discounts to take advantage of. So the following properties and renovations are all 35% off. Penthouses, penthouse add-ons and renovations, nightclubs, nightclub garages, and nightclub renovations. And the following vehicles are 25% off. The Progen Emirates Supercar, the Benefactor Krieger Supercar, the Pegasi Zoroso Supercar, the Viser Neo Supercar, the Ocelot Locust Supercar, the Vapid Peyote Gasser Sports Car, the Western Rampant Rocket Motorcycle, the Ubermach Zion Classic Sports Classic, the Vapid Caracara 4x4, and the Anus Paragon R Sports Car. And then for whatever reason, the Weenie Issy Sport is 40% off and the Weenie Issy Classic is 40% off as well. So those are your vehicle discounts that are going on this week. And there's also the same Twitch Prime benefits that are happening. You can get Pixel Pete's Arcade in Polito Bay for free. And you can also get an extra 10% bonus off of all this week's discounts. So if you have Twitch Prime, lots of good discounts in store for you there. And the only other thing that's really going on is the premium races and the time trials. The premium race this week is LSIA2 with a time trial of 2 minutes and 24 seconds. This is actually one of the new time trials that Rockstar started introducing a couple of weeks ago. And I've heard reports that it's really easy. So if you want a way to make a little bit extra money, there you go. The RC Bandito time trial this week is construction site with a part time of 1 minute and 50 seconds. And the premium race this week is art to art, which is locked to the motorcycle class. So there you go. Those are the changes that are happening this week. And as I mentioned earlier, everything is lasting for one week long. So you have until January 8th to take advantage of everything that's currently going on in Grand Theft Auto Online. And the only other thing that Rockstar mentions is what they do at the bottom of every Newswire post that says, look out for more details on in the coming weeks on future updates to GTA Online and head over to the events page for all the latest special bonuses, discounts, and sales. Pretty standard. That's what they say at the end of every Newswire post. But anyways, that's all the information that I've got for you guys in this video today. That is everything Rockstar has introduced today in Grand Theft Auto Online, including the Rune Zaba, all the bonuses for the new year, the new Lucky Wheel car, and more. I'd love to hear from you guys in the comments down below. What do you think of the newly introduced Rune Zaba? Are you going to be buying it? Are you going to be staying away from it? Will you get the trade price and then get it? Let me know your thoughts, opinions, and more in the comments down below. I'd love to hear from you guys down there. If you guys did go on to enjoy this video, though, a like rating would, of course, be awesome. And be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel if you are new or you want to stay up to date on all the latest GTA and all the Diamond Casino Heist videos that I'm going to be doing 
here on my channel over the next couple of days and weeks. And be sure to ring that notification bell as well. Sometimes YouTube just doesn't work, and if you ring that bell, you'll always be guaranteed to be notified when new videos arrive. But of course, as always, guys, thank you all so much for watching. Take care, and I'll see you guys in the next video.